Hi everyone, it's Thursday again, so that means that there's a new video on this channel. Uh, first, I wanted to welcome all of you, especially those new subscribers who have been subscribing over the last two weeks, so hello. Um, this video is a Q&A video in which I'm going to reply to the questions that you have left me over social media. If you don't know the links, they're in the description. And if you stay until the end of the video, you'll have some info about a giveaway that I'm planning. So let's head straight to the questions. Okay, question one. What is your project about? Well, if you're new and you don't know what this is all about, I would suggest that you check out video one, which should be in a card over here, and then come right back to this video because that way you'll have a very good context and then you'll understand everything. The second question is, uh, who are the actors? Lots of people have been asking me about who are going to be the actors for the short film. So actually, I am opening an auditions process. So if you're an English speaking actor and are planning to be in Madrid over the months of May and the beginning of June, then you might want to check out the information in the description below because I have there's information about the character description and how to apply to audition. So if you send me an email, I will personally review it. And if you're not an actor, but you have a friend who is, uh, I'd really appreciate it if you could get this information to him. What will you do with the film after it gets shot? So after it gets shot and it gets edited and everything is finished and polished, then I want to send it to film festivals because they are a really great way to engage with the, the audience. And that way I can get the reactions from people who are seeing the movie and to open up this debate over emotions. So that is what I want to do. I will do so through online platforms such as Movie Beta, which have worked fine for me in the past. But if the budget allows it, I would love to take it to a distribution company because distribution companies are um, special, specialized in this. So they know all about the short film festivals and what the best uh, film festivals are. And they, they can get your film to more places how are you going to fund the film? And this is a really good question because it is the one of the largest challenges for independent filmmakers. So luckily enough, the past year film that we made called The Collection um, got an award for 800 euros. So I want to reinvest that money into the new short film because uh, most of the crew who participated in the collection is also going to take part in the emotional project if they want to. So I want to, I want to be able to use that money for all of us to reinvest it in something that we all care about. And I think that's a good thing. And the second thing is that, um, well, actually 800 euros is just not enough to fund this short film because filmmaking is very expensive. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up crowdfunding, which you'll hear more about over the next few weeks. What is your biggest challenge or limitation? So as of this part of the project, I have two larger challenges, more than limitations really. Uh, first is finding good actors because I think that finding the right actors will make it so much easier for the film to come to life and to be enriched and to be, and to be authentic and that's what I want to do. And then the other thing is finding a specialist in VFX, in special effects because um, since this short film is taking part in a future world, it needs to be able people need to be able to understand that. So I want to include these little details that will show the story off and will enrich it. And the thing is that I've never worked with special effects before, so this is something new to me, but I think that bad special effects are worse than no special effects. So I'm concerned over finding the right person to take uh, part in this project as of, as of the VFX. So also if you're a VFX specialist, then you can also send me an email and um, I'll be happy to talk because I'm actually looking for you. Thank you so much for staying until the end of the video. And as promised, here's some information about the giveaway. I am giving away three months of free Netflix. I recently subscribed to Netflix and I discovered how awesome it is, especially because I could download certain shows and watch it on the subway or just when I'm around uh, without having to use my data. So I want to be able to share with uh, all of you guys and although that is would be super costly, I'm going to just raffle it for one of you. So if you want to enter this competition, just input your email down below through a link that you'll find in the description and uh, I won't share your email with anybody, only me and my producer will know. And you'll also receive some exclusive information um, that's not going to be posted anywhere else about the progress of the new sh uh, short film, The Emotional Project. So um, 
thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next week.